YouTube, it's Helen. It's been such a long time since I've made a video. I know, I'm really sorry. If I haven't been working and I've been doing uni work and doing my dissertation, which I've just handed in, yay. Um, so yeah, I've been really busy with life. It's just getting in the way. Um, basically, this is my Christmas bauble collection. It's mostly Disney. I think I have one that's not Disney. But, um, since it's Christmas, I wanted to do something really Christmassy. So this was as Christmassy as I could get. Start with my non-Disney one first, because if the rest of them are Disney, I might as well get this one out of the way. So this is my Universal bauble. I got it from Universal Studios the summer just gone. Um, if you saw my other video, I think I included it in my haul. It's been a while. I think I included it in my haul. But yeah, that's <laughs> that's my Universal bauble. It's got the Universal Studios on with the Santa hat, and it's really cute. And um, yeah, I'm really happy. There's quite a lot of selections, but I thought this was really nice because it's got the year on that I bought it. So, you know, added value. Um, this is another one that I got. It's I got from Disneyland Paris. Um, it's just a little Mickey Mouse shit. When I got this, the second time I went to Disneyland. The first time I went, I wasn't sure if I was going to get bottles, and I don't think I did actually buy any. Um, so this is probably one of the first ones that I bought. It's just really simple. It just says Disneyland Paris on it, and it's got Nice. Another one that I've got, which is one of my favourites, it is my Cinderella bauble. Um, Cinderella's my favourite princess, so anything Cinderella, I try to get as much as possible. Um, she's just really pretty. She's got snowflakes all around it. There's little stars inside. Can't really see them very well on camera, probably. The next bauble again is Cinderella themed. This one is one from this year that I got from the Disney store. It's um, Jack and Gus on the top of the bauble and it's got, I don't know if you can see, but it's got the carriage on it with the horses and it's glittery and it's cute and it's not very often I see Jack and Gus stuff together so I was really excited to get this um, and it's it's not exactly subtle Cinderella but if it didn't have Jack and Gus on it it probably would be a bit more subtle Cinderella. This is a selection that I got from Primark. Um, in England we have Primark which does all our Disney stuff but it makes up for us not having a hot topic in my um, so this is just a selection that I've got. I haven't opened them yet. Um, I only got them a couple of months ago in the um, Primark in Newcastle because it's huge and I knew I'd be able to find everything that I needed in there. Um, it's very glittery. Like I opened them just to have a look and I was covered in glitter so I'm really excited to have a super glittery Christmas tree because I don't have many just simple ones. I have a lot of character ones. I mean I know these are Mickey Mini but they're just a bit more, like they're a bit more Christmas all the other character ones that I've got. So I thought this is a really nice addition. Um, you can just get yeah, the Mickey ones are plain and the Mickey Mouse ones just have tiny little, well not tiny, but they've got little balls on. You can see that. Really cute. And they were really cheap as well, four pound. That, that's amazing. Getting out my box. <laughs> I have like two big boxes with all my baubles in. I've got ones that are like proper baubles and these are like character ones that aren't proper Christmas baubles. They're just like the character ones that you can get. So I keep them all together in here because they're just so lovely and I just never ever want to break them. Which I'm always worried I am. So this is the start off. These are amazing. They're so lovely. It's a candy cane Mickey and a wreath Mickey with different colored baubles on the like gold and red and it's got the little bow on. I got these from Disneyland Paris um, last year when I went for my birthday. Um, and I was meant to get them the first time I went and I really wanted them but I was too scared to buy them because I thought, oh my God, I'll never get them home, they'll break because I'm clumsy and I broke everything. But um, I bit the bullet and I bought them and I'm really glad I did because they're so nice and they're so nice just to put a new trailer in the middle of all your other stuff because they just blend in really lovely. This next one is my Jack Skellington one. Uh, I love Nightmare Before Christmas. It was the first, it's not the first Disney film I watched but it was the first Disney movie that I was ever officially obsessed with I'd say maybe. Um, I just remember really loving this skeleton guy that dressed up as Santa Claus and it sort of went from there. Um, but it's still one of my favourites and I was also really happy that I had the little vampire teddy on it because I've always wanted a vampire teddy and I've never seen one and then when I saw that you could get a Christmas decoration with Jack as Santa with his wreath and the vampire teddy I was so happy so I thought I need to get that and um, this is last year so this is a 2015 yeah 
last year's and beautiful. Anything Jack's doing. These two I'm going to shove together. I feel like I've got a lot of mess around me. There's all my Mickey Mouse paper that I saved from the Disney shops. <laughs> I'll show these two together. So I have a Cinderella which I bought last year because of course Cinderella can't not have a Cinderella one. And this is Belle. It's beautiful. I only saw this this year, but I think she came out last year. I'm not sure. But she has Lumiere, and Lumiere's my favourite from Beauty and the Beast. And Belle and Cinderella are like two of my favourite Disney princesses. Um, I just love them. They're glittery. They have cute dresses. And they're just nice additions to my tree in my little collection. So there's Cinderella and Belle looking super cute together. This one is my Jungle Book one. Me and my dad have always loved the Jungle Book. Like, from this is the only Disney film that my dad will happily watch with me. And um, he loves Baloo. Like, Baloo is his favourite. Um, and I saw this and I needed to get it. And it was meant to go downstairs on the family Christmas tree. But I wanted it on my Christmas tree, so I kept it. And it's just really nice. It's nice to see something Jungle Book. Because I feel like people forget about the Jungle Book. But yeah, it's a Jungle Book. Uh, my next one is, oh my gosh, as soon as I saw it, I bought it, like, I, I think it went out of stock and I panicked and I was really sad for such a long time that I was never going to get it. Then it came back in stock. It's the Peter Pan one when they're on Big Ben. So there's Peter and Wendy and then John and Michael are just chilling. There's no Tinkerbell, which I'm really sad about because I feel like it would have been cute to have Tinkerbell, like, on the top or something. This is my Sorcerer's Apprentice Mickey. It's one of my favourites. It's my favourite Mickey Mouse anyway with his little outfit and it lights up. Ah! It's so cute! And he's just chilling in his little hat and he's just really cool and as soon as I saw this as well I was like I need it in my life and it's just really pretty. There's not, with all of the Disney ones, there's not a lot of detail. You just appreciate the fact that it's like favourite characters and you can just have as many like Disney characters on your tree as possible like that's always just really nice to be able to just cover your tree with Disney. My last bauble which I said for last because it's my favourite. I got it from Disney World so that's how you know it's going to be good. It's in my last video as well but I don't care. It's beautiful. It's Mickey in front of the castle. It's glittery. He's got the bear. I always forget the name of the bear and I'm really sorry. I feel like a terrible Disney fan that I forget the name of the bear. It's like Walt Disney World. I kept the tag on it because I've just never, I just can't bring myself to get rid of the tags from it, the stuff I got from Florida because I don't know when I'm going to go back to Florida. I can't afford anything ever. So I keep everything wonderful. It's absolutely gorgeous and I'm so happy that I bought it. It was well worth the $20. Mouse, Cinderella, what more could you ask for really? So yeah that was a really really quick video, I feel like once I've edited everything it's going to be like two minutes long maybe if that, I don't really talk much, I just get really excited over Disney because who doesn't get excited over Disney really, except boring people but um <laughs> yeah so that's me, that's my Christmas video of the year, my hopefully not my last video of the year, like I'd like to think I'd do some more vlogging um, I really want to start getting back into doing these videos now that I've got less responsibility. <clears throat> so it'd be really good to start going back into doing all these videos again, especially doing as many Disney videos as possible. But anyway, thank you very much for watching. If you have any really cool um, Disney baubles that you want to tell me about, just shout it in the comments. It'd be really cool to see all the cool stuff that you guys have got as well. Um, so yeah, um, give the video a like, subscribe, all that jazz, and I will see you later. Bye!